Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. It feels like a long time since I've actually been in front of the camera. I am in a new place, if you haven't noticed. I moved in with my boyfriend. I, You probably know if you've watched my second channel that I started with Annette, my sister, on Sis Thursday. A link in the description if you want to check that out because we make videos every week. Yeah, I'm playing a new game now. I decided to stop the Doki Doki Literature Club mod Blue Skies because it was a lot and Halloween was fun. I played a lot, a few sessions with Max, but since moving in in December, my mind's been all over the place and things have been happening. But now I wanted to play this game, Omri, because it's something that I discovered in, I want to say 2017. It, I know, knew it was in development and it reminded me a lot of Undertale just because of the music and like the JRPG nature of it. It looks like it covers some dark and sensitive topics, so exercise caution when watching this playthrough, I imagine. I started a game before because I tried recording this earlier, but that didn't work, so I'm just gonna start a new game. So let us see how that goes. Don't worry. Everything is going to be okay. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Same with the flower in your hair. Promise me. Also, I'm sorry if you can hear any sound effect, any voices, like that's probably the neighbors. Welcome to White Space. Hmm. Boy is just sitting in a room with a laptop and tissues. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. Hmm. Interesting. I hope you you see as I do that the music is just so cute and I feel it's a little Toby Fox-esque. I wonder who wrote it, actually. So, I'm in this little space. It seems like I can walk wherever I want to. If I check up... Oh, what are you? Um... Okay. That is bad. It just brings me back here. It's not like I died or anything, but, um... So, there's one up. There's one to my right. Ooh, there's one to downward. Oh. Okay. So, I'm guessing they're on all sides. Yeah. Okay. So, um, I guess there's not much to do but to explore this area. Let's see. It's Z for in, in interacting with objects and X for going back. This is a tissue box for wiping your sorrows away. Cool. Miwo. Meow. That's a cute name for a cat. Waiting for something to happen? Yeah, kind of. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Okay. So these are interesting. Cats. Bathtub. That looks like a playground. Nothing else. Okay. Seems like it. And this is a TV. Or you booted up your laptop. It looks like it has like little white snow or something. Oh, the trash icon is cute. What would you like to do? Uh, stare at the screen. There we go. You stared at the screen. <laughs> what would you like to do? Let's open my journal. Omri's journal. Today I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today I visited my friends. Everything was okay. I spent time in white space. 
visiting my friends. So it's like a whole bunch of white space and friends. How do you even have friends in a place like this? Okay, let's just log off. Funny sound. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Oh. Earthquake. Something fell nearby. Uh, oh. Hey, hello. You got a shiny knife. I hope they don't do what I think they're gonna do. Oh, there you are. Okay, so I haven't tried the door. Let's see. A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Open the door. Certainly. Okay. Well, something's happening. That's for sure. Uh-huh. This is an interesting room. And I guess those are the friends that he was talking about. They're all jumping. Hi, Aubrey! We were hoping that you'd come by soon. This girl's name is Aubrey. Wanna play cards with us? You are just about to start another game. Oh, whoops. Never mind. Aw oh, man, what the heck, Aubrey? That is Kel. You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. This guy seems older, hero. It's just a game, after all. I like his attitude. Don't give me that, hero. You only say that because you were losing. Eh. Hmm. So she has a light bulb over her head, but I want to check out this stuff first. A tentacle is poking out of the ground. You got stuffed toy. Oops. What's that? Interesting. There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. Oh, I think I know that movie. I forget the title, but it has Joaquin Phoenix in it, I think. I don't know, a very young Joaquin Phoenix. A cat-shaped hole. Interesting. A baseball and a baseball bat. A single bean on a plate. And this is an interesting tree. A photo of someone familiar. It's a little shrine with little candles. Would you like to make toast? You made toast. Awesome. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. I've heard of body pillows, but not head pillows. It's a little weird. A neatly wrapped present. What is inside? A blender. Can't see the time. Let's talk to you guys. What's up, Omri? We've been waiting for you. Oh, that was Hero talking. I thought it was Kel. Oh, Kel's on the other side. Kel and Aubrey have been fighting a lot again. You would think they'd get tired of it after a while, but they're both just so full of energy. Yo, Omri, look at what I found the other day. It's a pet rock. Isn't he awesome? A tiny pet rock stares at you from inside Kel's pocket. I'm gonna name him Hector! Okay, Hector the pet rock. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know, the other day, that good-for-nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Omri? Pretty please? I actually think I have your stuffed toy. Is that? Could it be? Aubrey snatched the stuffed toy from you. Hey, Cal! Look, it's my stuffed toy! Wh what the heck? Where did you get that? Omri um, found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Serves you right, Cal. You should know better than to pick on others. 
But Aubrey started it. She was the one who was making fun of me for the mole on my... On your... What? Uh, hmm. I'm not gonna say anything. Aubrey? Fine. Okay. Well now, what? Let me talk to them again. Hey, Omri. I'm glad that's all settled. Those two always seem to be bumping heads. Marie and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? Sure. That would be cool. All right, everyone. Let's go see Marie and Basil. Okay. I am now in a little snake formation. Waiting for something to happen. Well, I'm going to get make something happen. S going out, Omri. Here is your allowance for today. You got 50 clams. I got my allowance from a snake. Nice. Okay. Ooh. We're all popping out. Okay. Oh yeah, fresh air at last! Gotta love that nature! Well, let's go! Okay. Hey, wait a sec! Uh, help me up, guys! I'm stuck! How did you get stuck? Only if you say please! Kel, Kel stop messing around and get me out of here! Okay, okay, fine. Took you long enough. A thank you would be nice. Well, sorry, princess. <sighs> okay. So, clearly the game wants me to go down, but I'm curious to see what's everywhere else in the other directions. So, let us see. Uh, not that way. You're afraid of spiders. Okay. I also see a creepy mist coming around. Omri is afraid of spiders. I know a lot of people are afraid of spiders. My boyfriend's afraid of spiders, actually. Let's see what's up here. Ooh, I hear seagulls. It's the beach! Do you want to build sand castles with your friends? Yeah. <laughs> They're making sand castles. Aww. All right. What did I make? Hmm. It's hard to tell. Looks like Almarie made like a tall tower. Kel or Hero and Kel made classical things, and Aubrey seems to have made some kind of little sand village rather than a castle. I thought I would be able to move and do something, but maybe I just have to continue. Okay. Yep. Okay, that's all I can do here. Thank you. Uh, oh, what was that? I went a little too quickly there. You're afraid of drowning. Yep, that seems like a ghost. Creepiness. Okay. Well, at least you could do sandcastles there. What is this way? Ooh, it's a pinwheel. With some wind. Ah, a ladder. You're afraid of heights. Well, that ladder does seem to go up into space. So Interesting. Look at all the copy pasted trees. Okay. So those are the three directions. Oh, that just takes me back. I'm going back because I want the story to go forward. Let's see what is down here.
there's a lot of things to explore here. Okay, here we are. Oh. <laughs> Two more friends. Marie! Basil! All right, everyone's gathered around. We got six little friends. Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again. Oh no, not again. I like her expression of like surprised Pikachu face. How could he? Psh, I'm not being mean. Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kel, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Ugh. Believe me. No, believe me. <sighs> Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. <sighs> you have a little music. I really like that about you. <laughs> oh. Come on, Marie. Not now. I ship them. Oh, Hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. Hmm. While we were waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through his photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course! After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this! Pose. Come on, Basil, take a picture of me! Sorry, Cal. I only take photos of people when they least expect it. You like to take photos of people acting naturally when they're not in front of a camera, right, Basil? Yeah. There's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there. <laughs> yeah, I guess you could put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Ah, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop doubting yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry. I'll try to believe in myself more. You guys should all try to believe in yourselves more, and don't, like, just say your work isn't worth anything and it's not that good, because you're still practicing, maybe you're still young, and maybe you're still practicing, but it's still good. Just putting the effort in is good. Definitely need to believe in yourself. Here. This way we can all see. So this, okay, shift, read. Marie is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Omri and Kel are holding Marie's example. Nice. So pretty. Uh, Omri and Kel gave up and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really fast. <laughs> so cute. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting it. It makes me think of a time like where I was making a dream catcher or something with my friend, and he looked a little frustrated and concentrated while making it, but it had ended up looking pretty good too. He got it in the end. I think we both had to had a very pretty dream we dream catchers by the end. You have to admire his persistence. Right, persistence is key. Aww. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy. Aubrey has some seeds on her face. Really? I thought that was like juice or something. Or drool. But yeah. Maybe someone should tell her. 
She's still cute. Kel drinking a bottle of milk. His favorite. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. That's a good point. Aww. Keep forgetting it's shift, not Z. Marie had Hero take a picture of us. Oh nice, so he's not the only one who takes the pictures. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. It does. Hero leaning in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Are they brothers, or is that just a thing you say with friends? Like, they're like brothers. They have brotherly love. I don't know. We're having a picnic today. Marie wanted to take a picture of everyone. Aww. I wonder if that's, uh, Aubrey's stuffed toy, the little eggplant creature thing. But I would I bet Hero has, like, a lollipop in his mouth or something. Say cheese! After eating, everyone fell asleep, except Hero and Marie. Hero and Marie seem like the the parent friends of the group. So, like Marie's the mom and Hero's the responsible dad. I don't know. Like if they if these were like kids in Wonderland, they'd be like Wendy and Peter or something. I don't know. Um, yeah. I'm getting kind of sleepy myself. Kel said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. Yeah, that's totally a selfie picture. It's not an accidental picture. If it was an accident, it would probably be blurry. Okay. All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet are whose? Well, Omri is probably the only person who has shoes. I didn't notice that the other people were barefoot. But yeah, it's hard to tell whose is whose. I guess that's the end of the pictures. Okay. Yeah. That was fun. These photos are all so charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Marie likes to steal my camera sometimes, as well as uh, Cal and other characters. Hmm. Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come out, come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, that sounds fun. Let's go. It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Okay. I'll sit this one out. You all go on and enjoy yourselves. But if you're ever feeling weary, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. And you can even save using my picnic basket. Okay, that's something that normal people say. Like, we're in a game. Aw, thanks, Marie. You're always doing so much for us. Bye, Marie. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. So Omri is the only one who doesn't seem to have a voice. So that's a little sad. Okay, let's save at the picnic basket. I'd like to save. Uh, I'm going to save over this because I played an hour of it and the playthrough didn't work. So I'm just gonna write over it. So there we go been playing for 21 minutes. Alright. So, uh, yeah, there's not much to this. Oh, yes, some nutritious candy. Would you like to eat some? Sure. You and your friends feel like new. Oh, so this is like a healing station, as well as a save station. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Okay. Well, for a first episode, I think I'm going to leave it here. I haven't gotten that far, but I think I'm going to make short playthrough videos just to space it all out and have more content. I want to say I'm going to keep doing Undertale content, but I'm really not sure. Still going to 
see how I can make videos over here given my current environment. But yeah, things are gonna be new this year since it's the new year. Yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. I really like this game. I bought it on Christmas, so that's when it was released, and I'm looking forward to seeing what it has to offer and see if it becomes my new favorite thing after Undertale. Not much else to say. Let me know if you have questions or comments about the game. Do you want me to keep playing this? I'm gonna keep playing it anyway. But yeah, subscribe if you want to see the future videos and comment and like and all that fun stuff. And I hope you stay determined and be persistent and consistent and that you're healthy and happy during this new year. Stay safe and determined, my friends. Bettina out.